In this version of the classic sponge ball routine, the magician takes a single ball and rubs it between his fingers to make it become two. Then he asks the spectator to place their hand on the table. He places one ball in his hand and one in the spectator's hand, but on the count of three, watch what happens. Now he places both balls into the spectator's hand and does a magical gesture. And when the hand is open, there are now three balls. He then places those three balls into the spectator's hand. He counts to three and does another magical gesture, and guess what happens? Now the magician takes the balls, one by one, and stuffs all four of them into his left hand. He asks the spectator to blow on his hand, and the balls vanish. Now take a closer look as the magician places one ball in his hand and one into the spectator's hand. Then he counts to three and the balls teleport together. Now I'm going to teach the secrets, but before I do, please take a second to like this video and if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. You'll begin by placing two of the four sponge balls into your pocket. Then you'll take another one and hide it in your hand like this. If you hold the hand natural, no one will ever see it. Now when you pick the sponge ball off the table, you'll roll the two together like this. It feels awkward at first, but the spectators will never see it. And you'll use your finger now to split that one ball into two. Now you'll ask the spectator to put their hand on the table. When you place the first ball into your left hand, you'll actually just mimic putting it there, but you'll retain it in your right hand. Practice this motion over and over until it looks natural. Now when you pick the second ball up, you're actually picking the two up together and placing them both into the spectator's hand at once. It's always good to flip the spectator's hand over after putting the balls in there so that they don't prematurely open their hand. Make sure not to squeeze your hand too tight so it's believable that there's a ball in there. Now as the spectator opens their hand and sees the two balls, that's the perfect distraction for you to reach into your pocket and grab an extra one secretly into your right hand. Now as you pick the ball up on the table, you just add this one to it. Again, as the spectator opens their hand, you'll secretly grab the fourth ball from your pocket. And as you pick the balls up, you'll secretly add that fourth one to the pile. Now, one by one, you'll pretend to place the balls into your left hand by jamming them in with your right thumb, like this. But what you'll actually do is let your thumb slide past the ball, and then catch it into your palm, like this. Now, as the spectator blows in your left hand, you can ditch the four balls into your pocket. 